we did what we had to do. We we uh, stopped somebody from being killed, basically. I actually was further away from the incident than the other guys. I didn't see what was actually going on at first. Um, Pierre was much closer to the scene and also Jermaine, I think. And they um, had seen that there was a bit of an altercation at the top of the stairs between the, the far right EDL hooligan, football hooligans, whatever you want to call them, and some of the Black uh, Live Matters protesters. So it looks as though the, uh, the hooligans got got dispersed, leaving one uh, one man standing and unfortunately for him, everybody set upon him. Um, there was a bit of a melee on the stairs. The, uh, the guy ended up on the floor and uh, these guys rushed in to, to, to stop, stop him from getting trampled. <coughs> in doing so, um, they created a barrier around him and I was sort of the last one to come in I uh, scooped him up into like a fireman's carry and um, sort of marched him out with the guys around me, protecting me and shielding me and protecting this guy from getting, you know, getting any further punishment. They were still trying to hit him as we were uh, uh, leaving the, the scene. I wasn't thinking, I was just thinking of, you know, a human being on the floor. Um, it wasn't going to end well had we not intervened. And that was it. I had no other, no other thoughts in my mind apart from get him to safety. So it was in our best interest to make sure that this, this man didn't get hurt, um, to get him out of there and protect what's, what's happening at the moment, the movement, protect, protect it all.